Grafana explained. What is Grafana? Grafana is a multi-platform open source analytics and interactive visualization. It provides charts, graphs, alerts, and a web interface where you can connect to the supported data sources. A licensed enterprise Grafana version with additional capabilities, it's also available as a self-hosted installation or you can use the Grafana Labs cloud option. It is also expandable through a plugin system. Why Grafana and for who? Grafana doesn't require you to ingest data to a backend store or a vendor database. Instead, Grafana takes a unique approach and will provide a single pane of glass by unifying your existing data wherever it lives. With Grafana, you can take any of your existing data from your Kubernetes cluster, Raspberry Pis, different cloud services, or even Google, Google Sheets and visualize it however you want, all from a single dashboard. Grafana was built on the principle that data should be accessible to everyone in your organization, not just to a single ops person. Grafana helps facilitate a culture where data can be easily used and accessed by the people that actually need it, helping to break down data silos and empower teams. When should I use Grafana? Well, Grafana is commonly used to monitor infrastructure and log analytics, predominantly to improve their operational efficiency. Dashboards make tracking users and events easy as it automates the collection, management, and viewing of the data. Grafana is great to deal with multiple sources that need to be accessed and aggregated in the same dashboard. Grafana excels here, letting you locate time series events, logs, entries, and custom queries alongside each other for immediate consumption. You could build an overview dashboard that shows hardware resource utilization, important log lines, and a graph of new user signups and your database as a single screen. This would give you one destination to head to when you need to the summary of everything that's happening in your organization. When not to use Grafana. For complex business intelligence or BI dashboard, Grafana might not be a good fit. Grafana does not come with a data collection or a storage mechanism as it relies on external data sources like we outlined before. Limited support for non-time series data makes it hard to work with. Limitation on dashboard organization and design compared to the likes of Power BI, Tableau, or even Apache Superset makes Grafana not an attractive choice for this type of actions. Doing log analysis is not suitable for Grafana as well. Some people complain about the setup automation that requires a bit more customization. I will close with the following. Do not create graphs when you don't understand the data. In my opinion, it's absolutely necessary that you know what data you are collecting and understand each and every metric that you are collecting. This way, you can actually use it for debugging. The best dashboards cannot help you find an issue if you do not understand the underlying data that you've collected before. When we don't actually know the data, we usually build wrong graphs and wrong dashboards, and this leads us to misinterpretation.